Hey, everyone! I need your help! Step into the 3D realm with Bucky and his friends. Explore a vast open island and hopefully bring your friends back to safety. So what do you say, buddy? Let's go rescue the gang! Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, everyone, I need your help. So what do you say, buddy? Let's go rescue the gang! the store to begin <laughs>
Okay, buddy, you go gather some paint. Now I'll get right to drawing.
and with Bach himself being a character Rex would produce more films of the same nature, until eventually, he was approached by a company who offered him the deal of a lifetime. Little did he know, this deal led to him selling off his character, as he was so quick to sign on, he didn't read very heavily into what he was signing into. To remedy this, he began to work on a replacement, and that is when Bucky Weaver and his friends were born. The popularity of Bucky not only went on to exceed plot, but Bucky went on to be one of the most recognizable cartoon characters.
Honest, uh, I'm gonna sound like uh, like a madman recording one of these things you know I I, I, I just kind of need to feel like um, I'm talking to someone even if I'm not so yeah um, <sighs> shit. Uh, where to start uh, you know this week it hasn't been the greatest oh uh, well let's say that lightly now this, this week has been horrible um, Everything feels like it's just going off the deep end, and um, I'm just starting to wonder how much I got left. Um, Harley's still in the hospital, and until she's out, I'm sitting in this office. It's it's big, it's cozy, yet it feels so empty. Not a single soul has entered this room in days, aside from, you know, myself. But, um, I, you know what, it, it doesn't matter. Just, uh, just, just remember your affirmations, and you'll be fine.
All right. Today is August 12th, 1996. We've been given the go-ahead to get back to work on the project. It's been rocky, but we're all getting back into it. Harry's been at his workstation all day, playing through, well, he's been stuck on all of them levels. The coconut one. Apparently, there's been an issue with the chests spawning in. They just appear a random, which is already bad. But then they soon vanish when you get too close. I'm really just not sure. It's very confusing. I'll figure it out soon. I'm sure of it. And Liz has been busy as always. She's trying to catch up on the game's artwork. We finally got a finalist design for the wolf guy. To it, but is that even enough? <laughs> His standards must be set astronomically high. Plus, after the, you know, the thing I found, I just gotta be honest. Today, the beach, park, and hull are all complete. Even got all of it here! It just need six. Sorry, I'm just kind of excited. Why am I sorry? Today's a good day. Um. Anyway, everything is going smoothly, I think. Liz needs to get back to me with Walter's Mall, plus his head texture. 
but it moves sailing. surmised that the length of a carrot divided by its diameter was always an integer. Frank, Frank, Frank believed that the sun was a giant carrot seen from one end. Attempting to explain his theories to... <laughs>
Bucky. I really bad incident. Vote hello, thing will be your hello. Stay out of the way.
Think about that one rabbit a lot. Stubbler, <laughs> yeah. I think the funniest part is missing arms. I managed to sneak in a jab towards Mark's wife and having her arm amputated. She was fresh on my mind when I was suggesting the idea to live. And hey, her making her a little guy hopeless romantic as well. <laughs> I thought I was the only one rotting down here. <laughs> so much has happened. So much. If 
call beyond your understanding. They call out to me. All four of them. I hear their voices skittering around in the inside of my wooden shell, even down to the pulsating mass laying beneath it. I need you to find me. It won't be easy to catch. You'll need to prove to me that you want what I have. If you do as I ask, you'll know everything. Every single detail of what happened. Why you are who you are. What do you say, friend? Let's give it a go. Thank <laughs> you. 
and you shall receive. Let's take a look at the little mess you've made. Connor, look, I'm gonna be honest with you. I've been playing this for about two hours now, and I'm not seeing the widespread appeal you've been promising us. It's, well, to be honest with you, it's clunky. I don't know what I'm doing. The characters who you promised would have depth and life. They are just flat. I thought that's the entire point of a 3D game. What? You oversold it, Connor. That's what I'm trying to say. My company is meant to be forging new frontiers. And, to be frank, after what happened at Studio Grounds, I really don't think this is going to be anything. It's not going to be anything in the same tier as our movies, our park, anything. And I really hate to say this, because I know for a fact you and your team put a lot of work into this game, but I just... I just don't know if it's worth continuing to sink money into. Sink money into? Mark, this is our job. You've had us working on this for two years, and now suddenly it's an issue? Yes, it's been two years. And in those two years, you've only sat me down now and showed me the actual fucking game. So, what can we do to fix it? No, Liz. This isn't a fix the game issue. It's a fix your perspective issue, Mark. You are sitting in front of some of the greatest technology of the decade, and you're gonna brush it off? Connor, I'm not brushing anything off. I'm just trying to understand where this- I'm sorry to say, Mark, but it's true. It's not that we've made a bad game. We've all exceeded the industry standard. What we're having a hard time passing is your thick skull and- Connor! Stop. Look, I'm so sorry about him. He's just under a lot of- Is it Harley? Is it not worth it anymore because you're trying to treat her instead? What? Yeah. I said it. Wh what are you bringing her into this for? Because I bet that's what you're gonna do. You can't keep funding our two years worth of work. Gotta buy her a fancy casket. <laughs> Unbelievable. Mark! Look, I... I'm really sorry. Now, Liz, you're fine, okay? But I want you to know that we are done, professionally. Right? I don't want to work with any of you guys again. Quite frankly, I don't want to see you guys touch our property. Any of that. Am I clear? Y yes Mark. You can go now. No! No! Because first of all, I want our equipment back. You can go now! You can go! Leave! Take a step closer. Lay a fucking hand on me. You lay one hand on me, I'm gonna make sure you stay in jail for a real long fucking time. Huh? Who are they gonna believe? You? You are nothing. I will be taking my leave now. Good luck in your future endeavors. I expect the office to be cleared by next week. Do not contact me again.